Hi, today we are going to learn how to replace content on the fly. CM Search and Replace allows you to easily replace text in all types of posts and pages, including theme and plugins generated content. It works via rules. You tell it X should become Y. Then every time a visitor visits a page with X, he will see Y. Note that the content will only change to the visitor. The change will not be applied to your database. To create a rule, navigate to Search and Replace – Settings. Under the Replacement Rules tab, you can find the dashboard for creating rules. To create a rule, we need to use the form at the bottom of the page. Let's start with some simple rule. For instance, we have a post with a book about Nancy Drew, and we need to replace the name Nancy to another one, for example, Regina. So we put a word or phrase that we need to replace into the text area from string. Then we put a word or phrase that will be instead of this to the text area to string. Then we need to choose a place where the search and replace will be committed. There are three options under the location drop-down. All – to commit this rule of searching and replacing everywhere on the site. Include – to commit this rule only on the chosen posts or pages. Exclude – to commit this rule on all posts or pages except the chosen ones. As now we need to commit this rule on one definite post, we choose the option Include and add needed post to the list. You can add any number of posts and pages to these lists. Then click the button Add new rule. Our first rule is created. Now let's see the result on the front end. Now to show the difference, we use the widget for enabling and disabling replacements. We will talk about this feature a little bit later. As you could see in this example, the rule wasn't case sensitive. We used the word Nancy with a small first letter for replacing, and all Nancy words with capital letters were replaced. Now let's create a case sensitive rule. We do all the same, but also turn on the option case. Now let's see the result on the front end. As you can see, the words with exact match were replaced. Managing replacement rules. There are a few actions you can do to manage your rules. Pause. You can stop committing any rule at any moment by just checking the box Pause and clicking Update. Uncheck the box to make this rule work again. Update. Click this button to save changes every time you edit the rule. Update DB. The main functionality of the plugin is making replacements on the fly without changing them to the database. However, it's possible to commit replacement rules to the database by clicking this button. Delete. Click this button to remove the rule. Save all changes. If you edited a few rules, you can update them all at once by clicking this button. There are additional options that you can set for each rule – timeframes and exclusions. Setting a timeframe means that this rule will be applied only within the range of dates and time defined in the restriction. You can add more than one time frame. To add time frame, click on the relevant button. A new box will appear for setting from and to dates and time for the restriction. To add exclusion, click on the relevant button. Adding exclusions means that this rule will not be applied to the chosen items like site title, page title, content, excerpt, and comments. For example, checking page title means that this rule will not work in titles, even if it's defined differently in the general settings. Under the settings tab, you can define some general settings for all rules. Search and replace edit page display. Choose if to display items on a single page or paginate them. Search and replace items per page. Define amount of items per page. Works only if you've chosen to paginate items in the previous option. Search and replace on post types. Enable search and replace for posts, pages or any other custom post types. Search and replace excluded posts or pages. Set here posts and pages that you want to exclude from search and replace parsing. Have a note that these two options have higher priority than the options that you define in rules. For instance, if in the rule you include some post to the rule for parsing, but this post is excluded in the option Search and Replace Excluded Posts or Pages, then this rule will not be committed for that post. Next five options have lower priority than corresponding options in creating rules, so they can be redefined for each rule. Search and replace in the site title, in the page or post title, in content, in excerpt, and in comments. Clean up database. This option will completely delete all your rules and reset the options. 
The plugin has a replacement widget that allows to control on the front end if to enable or disable a replacement. To configure the widget, head to the Replacement Widget tab. The options are Display widget for Select who can see the widget Show to anyone, show to logged users, or show to admin only. When the option Show to admin only is chosen, one more option is available. Only admin can save changes to database. In this case, the admin can commit permanent changes to the database for the post where he uses this option. Tooltip on off widget label. Here you can customize or translate the widget's label. Tooltip on off widget disable and enable text. Customize the text of the link disabling and enabling the search and replace functionality. Add to the top or bottom of each post. Add a widget to the chosen place. Have a note that it will only be added to the post types selected in the general settings. Now let's look again how it looks like on the front end. Following instructions found in the plugin and guides, you should be able to configure replacing content on the fly. Thanks for watching the video.